Welcome to X Factor presented by Xfinity. I'm Tori Petri here in Xfinity Studio, joined online by TJ Lang, who has a new prop this week. Tori, the uh, lucky candlesticks burnt out after a week, so we had to switch it up, and we're going with the lucky pool cues this week. Need a like win it. down in Jacksonville. <laughs> I like it. I like it. Well, hopefully you had a good bye week. We're going to jump in and talk some football. We need to know who the X factor is going to be for the Lions this week as they get back to it after the bye. TJ, who's it going to be? It's got to be Kenny Galladay for me. I think two touchdowns so far in the two games that he's returned. Um, if I'm Matthew Stafford, look, we talked about it in our postgame show after the New Orleans uh, game a couple weeks ago, Tori. We were surprised he only had four catches. He did still have eight targets, but uh, I look for him to, now that he played a couple games through the injury, got the week off with the bye coming back, hopefully as close to 100% healthy as possible, I look for him to be a focal point as a, of this offense because he's the one guy that you can always trust on to come down with those contested catches, the 50-50 balls that we saw here, uh, big play against uh, in the first quarter against the Saints a couple weeks ago. So hopefully get him more involved in the game plan this week, throw the ball up to him, let, let's see what he can do. So what you're saying is I should start kidding in fantasy this week. I think it would be a good option. I think <laughs> coming back, obviously he's scored in, in both the games he's played. Um, but look at the, just the trust the factor that Stafford has with him. Anytime he gets one-on-one -on -one coverage, you know he's looking Kenny's way. And Kenny really has a knack for turning those 50-50 catches into probably 80-20 catches favoring him. So, uh, yeah, I, I look for him to have a big game and, and, and get uh, a whole lot more targets than what he's been, been seeing so far. I like it. That is a solid X factor for the Lions. Now let's look at the opponent. The Lions head down to Jacksonville to face the Jaguars. Who is the X factor they have to stop this week? Undrafted free agent uh, running back, uh, James Robinson. He's their bell cow coming out of the backfield, won the starting spot uh, out of training camp. Uh, I know a big knack on him why he probably didn't get drafted was didn't necessarily have breakout speed. Well, tell that to the Titan safety here, number 31, who he just blows right by on this draw play for a big gain. Um, he's, he's by far uh, their best rusher out of the backfield. I think their second string back has maybe six carries on the season and – um, James Robinson has upwards of 70 and he's averaging about 4.6, 4.7 yards of carry. He's not the speedster that these lions saw maybe with Aaron Jones or, uh, Alvin Kamara type guy, but he is a guy that is just built low to the ground. He's thick. He just runs hard. He finds a gap and he hits the hole hard. So big focal point for this Lions defense is going to be shedding the blocks, getting off blockers and, and bringing down James Robinson, trying to make, um, Gardner Minshew and, and the Jaguars offense as one dimensional as possible. Yeah, this Lions defense has struggled at points this season against the run. And as we saw in that play, he is a tough guy to take down. What's it going to take to stop the run against him? What, what it really comes down to is, is I, I think the technique and the fundamentals, you know, you see the effort on film, you see guys get into the ball, you just see a lack of finishing the play. And I think that's going to be uh, to turn this, you know, the run defense around and, and try to turn the defensive season around, it's going to come down to finishing the play, getting off blocks, showing everybody that you, you obviously learn from the mistakes through the first four games. Hey, we're not going to let teams rush, rush down the middle of the field anymore on us. We're going to try to make it a lot tougher on opposing offenses. TJ, thank you so much for sharing your X Factors for both teams. Hopefully those lucky pool cues do the trick this week. We appreciate it. Thanks for watching X Factor presented by Xfinity from Xfinity Studio. I'm Tori Petri.